Federal authorities are said to be looking in Pakistan for a U.S. citizen accused of plotting a violent jihad. The suspect's name hasn't been released, but prosecutors say he was part of a North Carolina-based group of aspiring international terrorists. Investigators arrested these four men and three others Monday, accusing them of military-style training at home and planning terror attacks abroad. Prosecutors say they bought several weapons over the past year. And this summer, some of them went to private land to practice military tactics. The indictment against the suspects names Daniel Patrick Boyd as the group's ringleader, leaving members of this community baffled. Boyd's neighbors say he led a quiet life with his wife and children. I just don't know what to think about it right now. Used to see their boys fish in the backyard in their boat and go over and talk about gardening and stuff like that. Nothing political, nothing religious. Authorities say Boyd recruited the others, including his two sons, to join his cause to bring chaos to Israel and other nations. If he's a terrorist, he's the nicest terrorist I've ever met in my life. I don't think he is. Boyd's wife says her sons and husband are decent human beings. She released a statement Tuesday through the Muslim American Society of North Carolina. We are a good family. Indictments always seem factual in their appearance, but to rush to judgment is not a part of the process. And we kindly ask for a right to defense on the charges alleged by my family. The accused terrorists are facing several charges, including conspiracy to murder, kidnap, maim, and injure people abroad. If convicted, they could face life in prison. Sandy Kozell, The Associated Press.